<clears throat> Welcome to part five of this. I thought this would be the last part, but there was a part six. So, um, before we get started, I don't know who, but apparently someone's been going through and dropping a dislike on every one of my reactions to this series. I mean, come on, I'm a small channel. Give me a break. I don't even ask you guys to subscribe. You know what would be nice? If I could go one day without trying to propose to it. Anyway, let's, um, let's get to the video. You look dirty, or is that First shadow? First of all, I expect an apology. <laughs> hm. These beings do seem to regret their actions. I will accept their apology. Um, Miss Toriel? Yes, my dear? If I may ask, what the hecky happened? Hecky. Oh, there you are, my child. Yes, I agree that some explanation is in order. I like how Toriel is always polite, even when she's being a savage. Frisk, brothers, I have arrived. Come on! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Good look. Did that just make the Ender Dragon sound? Oh Lord. Why am I getting TF2 vibes from the music? But, wow. So, that is our side of things. Isn't Toriel just the best mother you could ask for? And what is my child doing near such dangerous creatures? So, uh, funny story. They're our attacks. They're not normally this bad. They're not even normally like this. Please don't be mad at them. They were just scared for Frisk. Yeah, Tori, they really are usually a lot more chill. Mine usually naps. The Pyrrhus just wants to hang out. We kind of summoned him on accident. Maybe you did, but I was showing off. I didn't mean to make a dragon, though. Yeah? Well, no, but at least I wanted it to be cool. And it is, bro. Even when it trips over its own tail. That was one time! Sans, yours got stuck in a tree. Oh, yeah. It was hilarious. And you were both too lazy to get it out for three days! Yup. <laughs> yeah, Mom, the attacks are really nice. They just didn't know you're a friend and were trying to protect you. Yeah, we're all on the same side here, the friendship side. <sighs> Perhaps <laughs> I was too hasty in my own defenses as well. Though I am still concerned that Sans creation was so eager to attack. It seems Buck yeah. only acted out of concern for my child's safety. <laughs> yeah, the Blasters care about him a lot. It's pretty cute. Sans, I thought we agreed to call them special attacks. Oh, um, we did? Uh. Really called blasters? Um. Sure. Blaster special attacks. You're not gonna say the name of the blaster. Who it belongs to? Who created it? Because they're all terrible. Anyway, I'm sorry about all this, Miss Toriel. I'm sure you and Frisk. Also, um, how did we find out that the blasters were named Gaster Blasters? I can't. I mean, it makes sense for him to have invented them, but uh. How did we so. learn that? Did someone like check the files or something? You are not so bad, are you? And you're oh. What expression? I know I've seen it before. Where? I think given all that has happened, perhaps tea is in order. That is a splendid uh, idea. You can tell us all about the teaching thing you went to. Oh, Papyrus. Oh, Papyrus. Huh. We. Uh. <laughs> Sorry. I'm moving a bit slow today. It is all right, my friend. Let's take it easy, as you like to say. I know <sighs> now where I have seen the attack's expression before. It is astonishing how our magic reflects us. Very. What? 
What the? May I join you? What? Uh, sure. Huh. I wanted to thank you again, my friend. Looking after Frisk while I was away is very much appreciated. Hey, it was nothing. Everyone had a good time. Yes. Yeah. Well, everyone except for you. Uh. <laughs> You're still worried about my nightmare? What are you, my mom? <laughs> uh. That's no way to speak to me, young man. Go to your room. <laughs> <laughs> not my real mom. <laughs> um, no, who is, though? About you. Also, it's nice how Toria loves children. Imagine. She's always willing to open up to new I ones. Antagonized it. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I mean, even do I do, even though I do support the whole dreamer family of Toriel, Asgore, Asriel, and Kara, um, it is nice to see when Toriel cares about others. Tori, I'm fine. I've actually been dealing with nightmares since I was a kid. The whole summoning a mythical beast thing is new, but I think I just stole the idea from my bro. He's really cool, you know? It's not that complicated. You know, Very imagine good. if Just know out of you nowhere anything, you were trying to sleep I have led a long life, and, and there is not much that could surprise me. Well, you heard your closet open, <laughs> if presumably you have one. On and Toriel oh, just walks out, right, lays some pie <laughs> down a point, my on a plate, and oh, then walks back in, closes it, and when you go to open the door, <laughs> she's gone. But the pie, it exists. Imagine that. Also, you probably. What on earth have you two gotten into? Yes, you. Yeah. What? May have been a little zealous in our rebuilding of the lawn. It is the most devious thing ever devised. Um. There'll be a genius puzzle architect yet. So what did you build? A classic pitfall trap. A, a trap. Okay. Well, that'll definitely be a surprise for someone. Who? Whoever drops in. Sans! Yeah. Well, brothers, thank you once again. It has been a delight. Frisk, get cleaned up. It is time we headed home. <sighs> oh, man. It's been forever since I was last in Mom's garden. So many plants. It's always changing. I have to see what's new. Huh? Oh, would you look at that. What are you doing here? I had to check up on my best friend. Didn't you miss me? We had so much fun together. <laughs> sure we did. <laughs> um... Listen, Frisk. What? Well, ever since we broke the barrier, I've been thinking. I thought huh. I'd just stay down there and think about what I've done and all that. Not to mention, look at the flowers. But, yeah. to be honest, that got really boring. Turns out flowers can live on their own just fine. I mean, that's not the real reason I was there, but... Yeah, it's Kara's grave. That's where the first fallen human was buried, wasn't it? Oh. Your best friend? Poor Kara. Yeah. Tori almost have thought she was being poetic in that spot. But my best friend isn't there anymore. So well... The flowers that grew on top of Kara are the very reason you survived that fall. In fact, you can honestly thank Kara for a lot of things. The whole plan failing, causing them to die, Asriel turning into a flower, and you gathering your friends at the barrier only so he can absorb their power, causing everything to break. Even though you're the only one who understands what having to reset was like. You didn't do that. Well I can't 
actually kind of makes sense. And you know I can't ever be hit again, right? Unless you reset and do all oh. that stuff again. Then yeah. I still won't stay that way. And maybe it's a little weird coming from me. I, I, I don't want you to reset. You made me see how awful I was. Rethink everything I believe. Oh. I don't want to forget any of that. I don't want to forget the stuff when I die either, all right? I, I mean, dying is not re a reset, reset, but still, when I, I die, I've, I I've seen a lot of so fun things. I've met a lot of well, good people. I don't want to forget everything when I die. But now that you're here, I don't, have I don't to even want to reset life. And a real family? I don't ever want to lose that, even if I could get it back again. Hmm. Yeah. About it sometimes, but it's not fair to ruin everyone else's happiness for my own curiosity. Yeah, exactly. Just okay. I set everyone free. Now I want to see what happens when I go back and kill everyone. Okay, time to start killing everyone. I'm sorry, Toriel. <laughs> oh my God, Kara, why did you kill Toriel? Yeah. Wait a second. If Flowey says he's killed everyone, then why does he need your help to get the souls that Asgore has? That doesn't make sense. It means he's killed Asgore and gotten the souls before. No! Oh, a stupid name! See if I ever help you again! Don't worry, I'm joking. I really am glad you want to stay. Surprising enough how Flowey has gone this long without being insane. Oh man. What? <laughs> Just before the outro screen could appear. But that was nice. That was very nice. Well, I'm gonna stop the video here. But, uh, yeah. Let me, let me ask this. Ha haven't you all been getting enough hints from me? Haven't I said this enough? I even had a video where... Isn't it obvious that I... You know, I'll, I'll just... I'll see you in the next video. Once again, it would be nice if I could go one day without trying to propose suicide.